All right, Section 3, Air Conditioning Refrigeration, Chapter 3, Inspection Maintenance of Air Conditioning Equipment, and Part 1, Electrical Mechanical Recommendation, Practice for Inspection Maintenance for Electrical Mechanical Air Conditioning Equipment, A1, the attention is given to the car's completion with each trip, the weekly, and additional with regular inspection of the car lighting equipment. 1, the battery condition of the battery should be determined, the grounds should be quit. Check the equipment of the wiring for the grounds of the test lamp have not been mo more than 6 watts of rating of the nominal uh, rated voltage equipment. The relay contacts fuses make visual inspection relay contacts fuses cleaning replacing wires and when necessary um, condenser and cleaning condenser coil with the compressed air and the flush water check with the water spray action with the thermostatic valve with the pressure switch valve that they use in conjunction with the evaporated condenser similar check should be made with the fully flo flooded condenser drain and flush and oil some out of the sump the evaporator subcooler and the fully floated full fu fully flooded of the condenser if they equip with the automatic water filling devices either the operation of the pressure temperature switch would see that the control of the relays and the floater operator properly inspect the pump leaks exp examine the spray nozzles of the condenser coil for cleaning if required inspect the motors of the brushware air con and the condition of the communicator even though for the water of the filter device does not automatically fill the sump to capacity with the clean water if equipped with the intake with the air filter cleaning during the free weather whether or disconnect the sump motor, interrupt the circuit, drain water for the sump, fasten water filler cover to prevent the acid on filling. Compressor unit 5. Compressor unit. When working and inspecting the compressor, the equipment always place the safety switch in the off position. As safety switches are not used, remove the motor fuse. To, if, if the safety switches are, are not used, remove the motor fuse to prevent accidental starting from the equipment. Inspect the compressor belts to be sure that the, all the air condition, good conditioning have equal and proper tension. When the belt replacement are necessary, only complete the match for that sets that should be used. They check the compressor, compressor motors, can enter any of the visible defects, the also piping the wells, fitting of the indication of the freon the leaks the freon leaks indicated with the collection oil dust at the point of the leak also always confirms suspicion of the freon leak of the approved leak detector D, the inspector the, inspecting the compressor motor, removed the inspection cover, the examination of the commuter and the brushes, replaced the brushes if warm with the condemning limit, it lubricate the bearings of the proper amount, type of the lubricant if required, run the compressor above, observing the cooling effect whenever the necessary for the bad use the cooling test terminal to run the compressor carefully, may, must be taken to remove the jumper when testing is completed, run to the dual compressor motor, the AC or DC when while running the AC check, use the DC charge battery for battery charging facilities if their car is equipped, make a similar test of the cut to cut of the cars equipped with axle driven motor generators Check freon level after the system has been operating for at least 15 minutes. Correct if required. Blower fan. Check the operation of the blower fan motor. Inspect the blower fan and motor brushes. The communicator. Observe the condition. Pulley belts and tension. That is, if the belt is if the belt driven fan lubricated is required. Seven control. All clean all the air conditioner panels. Blowing the compressed air with the vacuum cleaner. Clean. Uh, check all the thermostats. Proper operation valve. That including the opposite item thermostat. When use eight for the refrigeration expansion valves. Inspect the sol sol solenoid refrigeration expansion. Other valves that use the operation of the freon leaks at the same time make the visual inspection of all the piping the valves the air conditioning compartment of the freon leaks nine air filter inspect the air filter service as necessary check the condition of the filter shields the air fishing air fresh air also fresh air the controls but they are so in the car so equipped if the balancing the baffles should be maintained with the proper condition 10. The airflow. Determine the airflow is proper. The indicator light is to check all the indicator lights for the proper operation. Make the repairs where found and necessary. B. 1. The attention for the given the not monthly intervals in addition with the drip and inspection. Check the bearings. The heating with the noise. When necessary, the corrective with action should be taken. Check lubrication compressor with the compressor at the rest of the period of the 20 to 30 minutes. Oil with it, which used to bring the used required level and must be approved. The type to check the lubrication of the directional type of the fan driving unit. When are used, that lubricate the bearings as required. Lubricate all the belt and belt as lining screws and other threads parts of the frequent use six compressor when the wash compressor wash and steam all dirt accumulated oil the condenser although from the condensers inside of the compressor box when the excessive oil and the dirt is in the evidence of the part should be washed with a mild, mild solution of the dry sodium phosphate equivalent inspection uh, considers closely to see that all the air passages are open and free of dirt all right seven the low voltage relay. Check the operational low voltage relay. Um, re the low voltage protective relay for the proper dropped out voltage. Also observe the re uh, if the relay picks up re voltage reading in the check with the compressing run it. Eva eight. The evaporator inspect the air evaporator for the air ducts and cleaning the initial service as required. C one. The attention to given the cars as early as the seasonal inspection as in addition with the monthly inspection. One. The pressure switches. 
Check the operation of high and low pressure switches against the matter uh, master gauge to determine that if they are open or closed and required pressure for the particular type of the switch. Re 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 readjust if necessary. Two gauges carried on the equipment should be checked with against the master gauges replaced if necessary. Three, the refrigeration unit. Remove the compressor motor for the inspection, cleaning, and required repairs. Apply the installation test. The AC motor inspection should not be less than um, one mega ohm. It should be withstand 600 volts, 60 cycles, or AC for one minute without an approved test device. Applying insulation to the test of a DC motor insulation should not be less than 1 mega ohm and should withstand 220 volts, 60 cycle AC for the use of the 1 minute with approved test device. C. Clean overhaul necessary with the AC start power receptacle. C. Cleaning of the specification proper phase of the rotation. D. Inspection renewed when necessary. Flexible free on couplings if used. E. Compressor should be checked with the bent and shaft and the seal leak of the pulley fit. Gasket leaks and other defects when the unit resembled. Reassemble the compressor. Complete test with the Freon should be made with the proof of the leak detector. detector. Condenser. Remove the overhaul. Replace the condenser mo pump and motor pump motor assembly when you when it, where you use in Also use the fan motor assembly. All right, part two, um, section three, air conditioning, refrigeration, part two, um, engine-driven compressor recommendation practice, the inspection, maintenance of the standard work, Wickershaw work ice engine air conditioner equipment. A1, the attention is given to the car's completion with the ease of the trip, the weekly, or in addition with the regular inspection of the car lighting and equipment. Battery, the condition of the battery should be determined as recommended the practice of the maintenance of the battery grounds. The check of the equipment with the wiring grounds for the test lamp have not more than 6 watts rating of the nominal rated voltage equipment. The Wickershaw ice engine unit, the roll unit, and out of the extension tracks and the discount of the power supply plug from the unit, the preventing with the desired starting and the removal of all the covers. Check the visual inspection entire unit from the oil from the from the Vion leaks and the correcting of the heat, any of the leaks found. Always confirm the position of the Vion leaks as found with the visual inspection with the Hal die leak detector. Through, thoroughly blow out all the with the, out with the compressed air unit until the compartment of the condenser and the radiator surface. If the condenser and the radiator surface are, are, are caked with material will not, and will not blow off the air, used to be washed with a cleaning solution and pressure. Gone. Check the uh, check the engine oil level, which must be maintained with the full mark of the measuring the stick. And if the engine oil dirt and engine is due to the due to the due to the oil change, the drain drain the crank case, remain renew the oil filter element, bolt bolt bottom gasket, fill the crank case required to amount to prove the oil allowing for the oil, which will be held in the new filter element. C e the change of the radiator water level and fill is necessary. Water treatment is to be added with the uh, used and temperature demanded in the proper amount. Determine the tests are aimed up for the same with the type of the product checking unit. Check the visual inspection engine radiator water system for leaks and the hose pump cylinder head with the radiator radiator float with the expansion float tank system. If used, may, make repairs if time necessary. Clean the air take engine pre cleaner. If you on a unit equipped with the oil bath type, this will filter air, air apply clean oil. Do not um, fill with or above the oil level mark. Use the same oil applied into the can craze. G greasing the engine water pump to give in the grease cup one complete turn. Check the pump packing it to see that there is no leaks of the gland is not binding shaft the pressure is proper the when the gland is in tight enough to prevent the water leak one on later miles the rotary seal this is necessary check the tension condition engine fan compressor condenser fan belts always replace the belt if completely match match set check the unit while operating with such vibration knocks or other indications in proper operation or repair J. Check the oil level of the Freon compressor to see that the oil is circulating with the compressor on the bullseye after the engine of the operating of the less than 15 minutes. Check the oil pressure engine vacuum fuel pressure for the both high and low Freon pressure to check the operation of the vacuum switch high and low pressure switches. Check the crank limit and oil heat, heat breakers. Crank the um, limit of the element to be checked with removing the engine, starting the fuse and oil heat element, shorting the out the switch of the engine, running the switch has the switch does not trip the rate of time interval within a nominal voltage terminal element. Which be replaced with a new element to obtain the proper uh, operation. L. Checking the compressor oil level. To correctly determine the oil level of, of, in the compressor, um, allow the unit to operate 15 minutes, then stop the engine manually, depress the lever to, of the high pressure switch to, so that the unit will not pump down to stop. Then, after allowing the minute, minute, a minute or two to set, observe the level through the compressor bullseye. The oil should be at the center of the bullseye. And check for freon level if the receiver same type of the compressor oil level to check. The freon level should be halfway in the bullseye. Or add freon is required. Check the free you know, equipment through the leaks and correcting leaks as found and shouldn't be necessary to add freon. And um, examine the past solenoid with the freon, valve with the freon leaks to check the operation. Check the start of the motor, the satisfactory operation. Examine the proper linkage and adjustment to the pole. 
and coil armatures. Check magnetic spark um, plug um, wires and ensure that there are no loose connections that wires in good condition. Wipe the dirt from the person of open tank spark plugs. Replace the cover unit with a roll unit under the car. Place the track extension. Check all the see all the tracks where shop and the safety angles and other parts are securely bolted in place. Check to see if the power supply control plug is re, um, really re, re, reconnected. All right. Um, Fuel system. I pro I add propane gas is required. Reset the propane pressure regulators. If necessary, set the hose cylinders in the good condition. Check the propane fuel system for the leaks. Leaks can be dictated with the characteristics of the propane trace with the leak indicated with the boat. Same with the soap bubble. Test making proper repairs. Do not use the flame around with the propane pipe before use, making you sure all the gas has been blown up from the fuel lines. Check the fuel pressure again with the regulator the mercury manometer located in the electric ca control cabinet. When the engine operating with the pressure should approximately 4 ounces. When more than one fuel component is used the low pressure regulator setting with the ca second cabinet should be approximately two ounces higher than the other cabinet five evaporator subcooler and full filled condenser drain and flush on um, some ev evaporator subcooler fuel fu full flooded condenser if equipped with an automatic water filling device either the operating with the pressure temperature switch see the controls relay of the float operating with the properly inspect the pump leaks examine the examine the spray nozzle condenser coil with the cleaning required inspect the motors of the brushwork work condition Condition communicator if the water is filling the device automatically reef re sump the capacity and clean water if the sump if equipped with the intake of the air filter cleaning the, during the freeze water in the disconnected sump plug sump motor interpret the circuit to drain water from the sump and the fasting water fill the cover to prevent the accident fa filling. Blower fan. Check the operation of the blower fan of the motor. Inspect the blower fan motor with the brush as a communicator. Observe the condition of the pulley and the belt and the tension if the belt driven fan lubricated as required if the oil type of the bearings. Control air condition heating of the control panels for the blowing of the compressed air of the vacuum cleaner will clean all the thermostats to the proper operation valve with the including the outside thermostat when used. Refrigeration expansion valve. Inspect the solenoid refrigeration expansion valve and operating for the leaks. The same freon leaks at the same time. Make sure of the visual inspection of all the piping air conditioning compartment for the bring on lakes. Nine air filter cleaning change all, all the air filters check the condition of the filter shields and fresh air filter sh sh shutter controls if and so in cars are all equipped. Ten airflow. Make sure check the airflow in the air distribution. Check eleven indicator lights. Check the indicator lights for the proper operation, making repairs when found necessary. B one. The attention to the given cards at monthly intervals in addition with the trip inspection. The Wukasha ice engine unit. Check the starter bro motor brush communicator. Check the starter motor solenoid operating clutch. Clean the start or solenoid contacts. Renew the defective contacts when found. Check the magnetic fiber core coupling with the proper clearance of the zero. The, 15,000 of an inch between the coupling and the magneto impulse check to see if the magneto is driven the shaft the coupling was tight remove the cleaning spark adjusting the cap at the gas at the proper clearance of the 12 15 thousandth of an inch of the Edison split throughout or 25 thousandth of an inch Bosch care care must be taken with no dirt allowed to enter the engine through the spark plug of openings while the plugs are removed my compression of the test engine compression should not be less than 90 per CPSO of the cranking speed cylinder reading of the between the cylinder and not to vary more than 5 pounds. All right, E, check the engine operating speed. The speed of the commander correspond with the speed shall be Waukesha service manual to read adjustment necessary. Check the engine for the fuel fixture. Make sure adjustment that can be must be the readily check with adjusting the means of vacuum gate of the fuel mixture adjusting. It should be such that the engine should return running in the constant adjustment shall be so much and constant load that the highest vacuum reading that is obtained with the vacuum gauge should the gauge read less than six inches of vacuum. Look in the incor incorrect carburetor. Adjustment low fuel pressure time out of the adjustment and the other source trouble should the gauge fluctuate violently look for the faulty engine valve This should also be indicated when making compression test in paragraph B11 D in addition with servicing the engine air cleaner the per a one three five three F cleaning clear clean crankcase bay breathing cap drain um, H drain the radiator flush engine cooling system with a strong resolution Draw our song strong solution of trisodium phosphate drain flush and with the clean sulfur water water all right um c1 attention is given to the cars are yearly the seasonal inspection additional with the monthly inspection 
Grounds apply installation of the test of the DC motor controlling wire. Installation should not be less than 1 mega amp should be within 220 volts to 60 cycle AC for 1 minute. With an approved test device, making corrections is required. Wickershaw Ace Engine Unit. Drain, change the compressor oil at the start of the, each of the season operation. Compress the oil as used to be the high quality refrigerant oil mo mo moisture, having the say bolt the viscosity of 300 to at 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Check all the belts and air engine fan, compressors, condenser fan, the renewing of the wind necessary, element renew engine fan, condenser fan belts. At least once each season, preferably at the start of the cooling system, we use the mats to set instead of the belts. Um, remove the engine head ease of the carbon head block of the grid engine with the valve, the valve seat, and adjust the tarp tabbits. Replace the head with the new engine head gasket while head is removed to check the cylinders and the macro matter. Either for excessive uneven wear and the condition warns and necessary repair for the bolt. Uh, replacement should be uh, made to examine the head closely if any of the cracks are the facts of D. Renew the spark plugs at the start of the each of the cooling season. Remove the completely overhaul grease and reapply with the magneto. Inspect the fiber, coupling with the wearing, and renewing the necessary. Check all the breaker points in this balls for the mechanism, renewing the worn parts where necessary. Move completely overall, reapply with the completely uh, starting motor assembly, check all the brushes, contacts, moving parts, replacing the defective worn parts if necessary, check the rear gear, ring gear, visually inspection through the start application upon opening to determine the condition of the gear, renew when necessary. Move the completely overhaul, replace the packing, reapply the engine water pump once in each season. Rotary pump should seal to use, remove the overhaul, reapply once in each season. Drain engine, flush oil engine, oil lubrication shall be the flush oil and refill the cleaning lubrication oil. Overhaul engine governor, all moving the parts of the engine modulator. After doing the uh, above, check the engine speed setting and the adjustment as made required. Details and structure for the engine speed adjustment as fully required in the Wickershaw Haw Service Manual. Checking the proper operation all the protective devices, engine oil, heat oil, and switch, green light switch, the low for free freon press switch, the high freon pressure switch, etc. Test high low pressure for the adjustment master gate to and above the work to be done with not less than one each of the seasons. See the starting the cool season, cooling season. Carefully inspect the wear to defects all visible moving parts, engine, compressor, and equipment. Make careful to check the operation of equipment indication of defects within the bearings, but balls and sleeve shaft, pulleys, fan, motors, ma magneto gears, pistons, pins, worn engine engine bearings indicated with low pressure engine operating with the best worn piston rings, cylinder walls will indicate the gradual increase of lubrication and oil consumption. All indication of the pretty tanning the defective equipment operation must be carefully analyzed and proper the repairs made. Um, L. Renew the engine cooling system and radiator hose. Also, expansion ta ta tank hose if so ta if equipped. Remove the adjustment and calibrate one gauge tester if on pressure gauges. Remove the clean adjusting the engine valve, valve vacuum switch. Clean the refrigerator suction liquid strainers once each of these season. Apply the dehydrator charge if necessary. Inspect the clean and necessary refrigerator and bullseye glass and liquid receiver and the compressor. Remove the inspection and repair all the refrigeration and like of the solenoid valves. The expansion valves one each of the seasons. Carefully check the replacement when necessary. All the valves heating shall indicate the wear. Three, the fuel system. Remove the assemble, inspect, review, clean, and renew the worn parts of the engine propane fuel system, including low high, pre high pressure regulators, low high pressure excess below flow valves, check valves, piping, any other valve, any other parts of the fuel system, any other parts of the way there are reassembled, making a complete check of the engine propane gas system, propane leaks, the super sud soap, sud test, making repair the founding necessary. Do not test for leaks or flame test with the flame test. Work under the car or with open or work under the car with open flame until the propane system is free of leaks. Wire brush propane gas cylinder to remove all the rust, corrosion, or paint, the aluminum, barrage paint. The service can usually be performed with a propane gas supplier if, if required, if, or if desired. Evaporate the subcooler full flooded condenser, remove the overhaul, replace the subcooler condenser pump and or fan motor assembly, repack the pump, clean water strain as a spray nozzle, thoroughly clean the coil and sump corrosion, check all the equipment, Louis ice engine, subcooler propane, fuel, fuel carrier for corrosion, carefully clean and paint all parts showing indication of the same. Consider, considering the above the difficulties, analyzing and serializing equipment, all types of the operating conditions such maintenance can only be arrived through experience, although the preceding paragraphs over the paint is the general nature such for 
service. It can only be served as a guide. It cannot replace the actual operation experience with the individual conditions. Recommendation of lubrication charge of the Wickershaw Ice Engine Air Conditioning Equipment. Charge the engine lubrication on each 300 hours of engine operation. Use the high-quality automotive type SAE 9, number 10 oil during the cold weather. Use SA number 30 for oil during the summer season. Repack change oil filter element in the type engine oil change. Check the preamp compressor oil in once each of the two, each cold season. Check oil level weekly. Maintain some of the midway oil level in the bullseye grease engine fan. Yeah. Grease the engine fan each season. Grease all all my fittings, including the compressor pulley belts, and once each month. Turn the grease up on the engine water pump, then one complete turn each week. Um, use the automotive water pump, the grease oil with light weight, and use them sparingly. Start of the motor bearings and brush holder bearings once each month. Grease the unit mounting wheels once every three months. Oil with the light and weight, weight, weight oil. Using sparingly magneto once each of the use season. Oil and greasing to be done at the time of the magneto overhaul. 10. Cleaning the engine air take fill in the proper the level of the clean oil in each of the week. Do not overfill. Clean over the oil filter breather cap once each month. Clean the oil, moving the parts of the modulator control once each season. Tabulated data. Cover all the parts of the sheet, IC engine, and the proper fueling system as shown in Washika service manual. D. Attention to give it the propane fuel system in addition with the periodic inspections. 1. The fuel cylinder, the proper fuel cylinder item in the figure A, item A, figure 1, and commonly used with the passenger in conjunction with the propane activated equipment. The cylinder manufactured is under the ICC 4B classification unit. Uh, classification and built for the normal operating pressures and requirements of 240, 260, and 300 pounds. These cylinders may, must be tested and required by the Interstate Commerce Commission regulation of the transportation of explosive and other dangerous articles in Specification 4B. Specification of cylinder testing is the same with the cover of detail in the Bureau of Explosive Bills and further expect of the brevi bre brevity it will not be quoted to the year and the exemption to most commonly used water jacket method for testing describe the fuel cylinder testing water jacket method. Many early cylinders not known, known in service were supplied with the number 2759 valve. Subsequently revised 2759R and 2759 W single three quarters of an inch IPS opening. The valve um, performs several functions of somewhat the complicated design that say provided not only with the shut off condition with the spring loaded relief, the fuse, old plug, and excessive flow check of the outlet check of those construction past experience service problems that have been indicated the desirable setting operating function is provided with additional openings and cylinders and it take number three one two twenty three K spring loaded relief and number one five three one fuse plug and recommended that the type no new type of the cylinder is specified with all future purchases additional replacement placement cylinders. If the further recommendation of the old size cylinders but the single open single opening with converted with the new type of the manufactured cylinders are the valve then established with the standard charge of the modification the most of the economical time modernization is a retested date when repair such as the replacing of the foot ring is necessary any is any of the welding operation on the cylinder requires retesting of the time of the repair is made. All right, fuel your fuel cylinder valve. Your fuel the cylinder valve with the item to be the figure one with the initial safety valve of the propane fuel system. The proper function of the various elements of the valve. The idle importance for the safety passenger and the equipment that prepares the adjustment of the valve should not be permitted by any of the person not familiar with the familiar with all details and hazards involved. All repairs of the replacement broken handle, the seal plug, should be made only with the manufacturer propane gas suppliers with other trained authorities and then by the manufacturer who has established the standard repair for the exchange service to cover the necessary work following. A brief description of cylinder valves now in use. The valve number 2759 of the valve is not considerably obsolete, should be withdrawn from the service. The capacity is insufficient present with the day of the requirements of the parts of the interchangeable with later construction. The manufacturer has provided the exchange service to replace the valve in nominal charge. Valve number 2759R, the valve is obsolete and can be modified with the number 2759W with construction. The manufacturer has provided with the exchange to modify the valve with nominal change. Valve number 2759W, the valve is satisfactory in the present day. The requirements should be continued to the service unless the cylinder is it, um, modernized the new standard of the relief valve the, and the cylinder is so manufactured to provide the repair exchange with the service of the valve with the nominal change. Um, let me have a sketch up here. I'm going to back out of it.
All right, I lost my place. I'm sure we're not on steam injectors yet. All right, this is an electrical section. Um, you got the ice engine. Um, we're going. Uh, yeah, it's uh, position one, two, and three. Propane fuel system. Uh, engine generator. Low pressure regulator valve. Pressure hoses. Case surge. Global shutoffs. I'm sorry, I, you know, I can't even read it. Really... Alright, D valve number 7107. The valve is going to be, uh, has been used with the new standard to have the cylinder be continued with the service in normal life with the repair necessary. The excess flow check of the valve parts the new design should be used. These parts are the same. Are used the number 7128 and valve. And then when the accessory replaced the component valve with the number 7128 should be used. Valve number 7128. The valve will use the latest shop of the cylinder with essential features that excess flow of the check of the valve and improve the design and completely inside of the cylinder is protected from damage. The 7128 includes the outlet check valve lock nut with the resilient wash each of the position piston, positioning and the tightening of the valve of the cylinder with the seal plug with the chain most internal championship parts of the interchangeable the part with the used in 2759 2759w valve the high pressure propane hose High pressure hose pro pro propane hose item C of the figure one should be tested with the propane leaks with the soap sud test once each for sixty days. Due to the deterioration material can compromise the propane hose propane hose with the period of the time depending on the type of the service leakage may develop through the flexible hose. When this develops the hose should be replaced and the defective hose scrapped. Bra brass fittings were um, where found in the damage rough handling and other causes must be repaired with the found defective. The most frequent defective occurring with the brass fitting is the slightly indentation of the bearing phase of the fitting within the screws into the cylinder valve. This Defect may be corrected with the refacing, the fitting, of the dressing, the tool taking care of that, not to remove the excessive amount of metal. Um, reverse flow high pressure check valve number 2760A, 2760AC, 2760B, 2760BC. The reverse flow check valve of the item D of the figure one enclosed the automatically to prevent the discharge of the overflow other than flow fuel cylinders in the event of the flow fuel hose connection eruption and automatically again with the nominal fuel resume the valve. Um, should be tested annually repaired when the finally defective instruction testing repair covered with the Bastillion Blessing Company Bulletin number uh, um, L348 high pressure regulator number 276 and 2676W the high pressure regulator item D figure 1 reduces the tank pressure down to 10, 20, 30 pounds per square inch and etc. The valve operates follows the pressure of the lower speed of the diaphragm is reduced and the spring of the top of the side of the diaphragm forces it down the valve seat is being attached to the diaphragm the valve steel and will open and allow the gas to flow out of the inlet and pass the valve seat so up to the round of the valve seat and the outlet side of the pressure adjusting screw located at the top of the regulator increasing decreasing the spring pressure of the top of the side of the diaphragm thereby increasing then decreasing the gas pressure necessary for the lower side of the diaphragm in order to open and close the valve adjusting should be made with the engine running the regulator should be checked with the proper pressure seating weekly instruction testing repairing both the 276-1 and 276-1 w as was the conversion of 276-1 and the two to the 276-1 w is converted with the Basilian blessing company bulletin number 
L348, the high pressure pressure, excess blow valve, the number 2763W, high pressure excess blow valve with the item of F, the figure 1, closes to the break of the, anywhere the high pressure view lines between the first and the second stage pressure regulators, the valve with the auto, will open automatically a few ma minutes when the pressure equalizes, there is bro no broken um, line. The valve should be tested annually and prepared with the final defective instruction testing, repairing with the cover with the Bastillion Blessing Co um, Company Bulletin number 11, uh, L348. Um, global shut off the um, valve with number 276276 W2553 um, 2553 W shut off valve item G figure one of the hand operative to use with adjusting the high pressure regulator changing the fuel the cylinders of the valve should be tested quarterly with the leaks of repair necessary instruction of the testing repairing the cover with the bill Bastien Blessing Company built number the three L three forty eight the fuel gauge fuel gauge item H anchor indicates the low and in that pressure for the low pressure regulator the gauge should be checked with the master gauge annually and if found the defective it should be replaced. All right, um, your low pressure regulator number numbers two fifty um twenty five hundred R R and twenty five zero three C and two two L. The low pressure regulator item that one figure one reduces the gas pressure from ten to twenty thirty etc. Um, pounds in the inlet of the sides of the four to six ounces the outlet of the fuel cabinet bank cylinders with low pressure regulator have the high pressure of the setting of the equipment empty fit. First, 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 the screw located at the bottom of the regulator adjusts the spring pressure of the diaphragm, regulates the pressure of the gas, leaving the regulator the gas pressure above of the diaphragm is lower than four to six ounces of the spring force of the diaphragm, actuating lever arm, which turns the opening of the valve seat. The as the pressure above the diaphragm builds up, its force assembly down to the close of the valve. The main of the diaphragm breaks will discharge with the same, will discharge from the safety vent and the regulator say it is bad order. The safety valve will and diaphragm assembly will open the discharge gas and safety vent, indicating the defective regulator. Regulator. The regulator should be checked for the pressure setting monthly, overhauled, repaired, and necessary annually. Instructions for testing and requiring a covered Bastillion Blessing Bull Company num Bulletin number L348. Alright, um. Your low pressure excessive flow valve number 2779W. Uh, low pressure excessive flow valve with item J. The figure one operates as flows. The break or leak of low pressure after the main regulator with the flow approximately 125 feet and cubic feet per hour, one minute, or sorry, one cubic feet per hour more than close to the valve with a series of three quarters of an inch of one iron pipe fuel line with the engine. If the valve with the close with the permanent prematurely, the provided with there is no broken line, then this valve will open again automatically in a few minutes. Will pressure with the equalized provided with that there is no fuel demand. The vis Valve, unlike the high pressure excessive fuel valve, the operated with the diaphragm is much sensitive to the flow gas. Do not attempt to adjust the valve over the car, replace the defective. Check the proper operation quarterly. Defective valves if one, are once um, removed overall the annually. They should be disassembled, repaired as required. Tested that they should be made in accordance with the Sicilian Blessing Company built in number to L348. Um, 11 surcharge of the item cave of the figure one requires the maintenance of the recommendation of the facility a engine of the cup is starting with being applied with each of the fuel lines between the cabinet fuel cabinet and the unit the surcharge amber prevents the low pressure excessive flow of the valve with a sl some slugging and um, a normal engine cranking particularly in two units starting at the same time the capacity of the surcharge surge chamber should be about 400 cubic um, inches all right, 12, your low-pressure propane hose. The low-pressure propane items, item L, figure 1, show be tested. The propane leaks as a soap sun test each one sixty each 60 days. It is important that the hose with the metallic and other material properly supplied with the, between the car body of the unit provided with the kinking of the breakage and when the unit is rolled out in the extension tracks for the servicing as well as when properly placed under the ZE track car for the unit return to the normal operating position. Damaged leaky hose should be replaced with defective one scraped. 12 automatic shutoff regulator and automatic shut regulator item M. The figure one located with the engine compartment of the near the carburetor shut off the fuel supply whenever the machine the engine stops. Furthermore, the engine runs with the regulator meters. The quality of the fuel engine accords with the power requirements of the pressure um, slightly below the atmosphere. Main unit is for the part of the engine unit the shown in pages 321 of the 326 of the manual covering the recommended stand practice for the inspection maintenance manual of the Wickershaw Ice Engine Air Condition Equipment. 14. Propane piping. The recommendation of all propane piping will be carefully checked weekly and for leaks and order test the characteristic propane trace of the great gas smell that entirely enter the piping system test for the tail leaks annually the means of soap bubble test and not less, less than 50 pounds pressure of piping system. Fuel 15. Fuel cylinder in the cabinet heating. The, uh, the common practice 
In the propane system usually recommended to the least of a fuel cabin, the double cabinet stream system equipped with the automatic heating and the desirable aim at a temperature of 30 degrees Fahrenheit lower. The cabinet is heated with the usual length of having about 6 ounces of the heavy highest setting of the lowest pressure regulator so that the fuel cylinder has been equipped, uh, heated with the empty first. Normally the passenger cars with both engine and generator ice engine units with operating cold weather the fuel supplied with the heated cabinet and can consider adequately the ice engine will operate with a small portion of the time after if, it, if at all. Figure one shows the piping arrangement automatic control with the steam heat system. The vapor number of six one one the vapor number of one six six eight steam admission valve is set to the automatic position. Only in emergency should the valve be set off or the on or manual set to be on the manual off or on position. When the propane cylinder valve pressure may drop to approximately four pounds to decrease the ambient temperature of the contact control switch, close the engine there and drainizes the number one one six six eight steam valve. Valve opens and energizes steam low pressure, but then passes the cabinet steam in coils and the heat in the fuel cylinder. The after vapor pressure of the cylinder increases the two to three. The contact control switch open the de-energize the number so one six six eight steam valve standard type of the retard steam trap to protect the steam piping from freezing. A one MFD four hundred volt and condenser is is connected across the contact of the control switch to protect the contact switch. All parts. All parts of the steam heating system, include the controls, should be overhauled and annually checked for the proper operation, replacing the worn-out, defective parts. One of the similar earlier type of the fuel cabinets, um, engine exhaust gases, and are used to heat the cylinder fuel pressure control of the exhaust by bypassing the valve, which the bypass hot engine with the heater the pads located under the fuel cylinder. Uh, we still got more to do. This is the long part. Method of testing um, f the fuel system. Fuel supply is pre pressure. The sequence of emptying the fuel cylinder. See figure one. The fuel pressure shown in the gauge will depend on the number of the fuel cylinders and fuel cabinet is shown in the engine running. Outside temperature must be zero degrees if one cylinder 10 pounds, two cylinder 20 pounds, three cylinder 30 pounds, four cylinder 40 pounds. It is assumed that each cylinder consists of a sufficient fuel at least three to four pounds. Otherwise, pressure might be considerably low. The pressure is in the car line from the low pressure regulator to the engine regulator it should be four ounces when the signal cabinet is the four ounces of the six ounces of the two fuel supply will cabinet once are used. Be sure to set with the bolt and engines running with the various pressure but remove the bonnet cap of the center leg large regulator item I and turn the adjusting screw clockwise for the pressure and countering counterclockwise to reduce the pressure. When uh, when two fuel cabinets are used, they usually convenient for the dab. The fuel always driven to the cabinet first. But they, those cylinders are empty. These can readily be accomplished regulating normal fuel cylinders at each of the cabinets. Heating the low pressure regulator, one cabinet, the one steam heating, the maintain two ounces of the high pressure for the engine. Then from the other cabinet, thus one regulator maintains six ounces when the engine was running, and the other four ounces. The fuel full flow with the cabinet cabinet at high pressure for the until the fuel cylinders of the cabinet are approximately empty. Then flow from the second fuel cabinet. In this case, the three-cylinder fuel supply the fuel first from the right cylinder, each of the cylinder number one manifold, maintaining the pressure approximately 30 pounds of the main regulator, 40 pounds of the four-cylinder if used. Also, the cylinder maintains the pressure of the fuel flow from the cylinder, allowing the unit to uh, empty to until the less about 20 pounds of the fuel remaining. The manufacturer pressure drops approximately 20 psi pressure with which to stand the second cylinder cuts. The fuel now flows from the second cylinder and used until empty. The third cylinder is automatically a cut and Apply the fuel approximately 10 pounds pressure from the main regulator. As if the fuel pressure gauge with approximately 30 pounds with the engine running, the apparently the first cylinder is supplying the fuel. If the gauge supply shows approximately 20 pounds, then obviously the fuel is drawn from the second cylinder. The filler cylinder now being empty, that meaning removed, similar to the gas shows that approximately 10 pounds. Both first and second cylinders are empty and may be removed due to the variation in the tank pressure of the outside temperature. Each tank should be weighed in exactly. Fuel content must be known. Note, in all cases, changing the fuel tanks, the cylinders in use with position number one, loaded position number two and three, full cylinders, opening the valves, the cylinders number three, first of the cylinders number two and one, at the procedure indicated that each of the tank applying the fuel is in the proper sequence. Testing a fuel system. Any regulator high level of permitting pressure to verify the engine with the running of the rise excess of the engine that is top of the should be removed from the repairs. Excess flow should be removed. The service and tested periodically indicated before going in accordance with the instruction contained with the Bastillion Blessing Company bulletin number L348. Generally, in recommendation, all the parts of the propane fuel system, including the piping, may be, be removed annually and completely overhauled and tested.
Tested, servicing, repairing the cylinder, cylinder valves, and fill, filling plant. Before filing cylinder inspection, inspecting cylinders should, condition should uh, for sharp, can, check inspect cylinder condition for sharp, dense cuts, gashes, loosely, badly damaged foot ring, server, rust corrosion, or prevented test date. Um, if the condition appears hazardous, cylinders must be removed from the service until the condition is corrected. If cylinders do the re for retest, this should be done in accordance with the LCC regulation. To your cylinder valve tests, uh, all cylinders must be tested in accordance with the following instruction before and after the cylinders are charged with specified with all the value of the valves failing to the past inspection are to be removed and replaced with a new or reconditioned valve. Le leak test joint connection, the test for residual pressure of the cylinder, the, of the pressure test card gauge, the figure 2, the installation valve of the outlet, opening cylinder valve, and if it indicated with the pressure less than 50 pounds, place the cylinder on the charging scale with inject 4 pounds of propane. Without seat seal um, plug removed, only open the valve with the turn counterclockwise, one turn only. T all the joints connection, as well as the outlet check for with soap suds. B leak test with the valve shut off. Close the shut and cylinder valve. To install the test unit. No big video number two. Apply the soap suds. The unit is discharged and end the open the test the test unit valve. If main the valve is seating properly, no bubbles will form. To test successful flow chart, check the flow of the test unit. Figure 2 will open the cylinder valve slowly. Open the test valve when observing the pressure of the 15-pound gauge. Successful flow check must not close be below 1 PSI. Must not close at B. Pressure of excess of 9 PSI. Relief valve. Check the test date and the color. If the date of the color indicates more than three years of service, replace the new chain exchange relief valve. When the cylinders are equipped with the 275-9W valve, it is important to fuse the plug of the 283-3F relief valve upward not more than 45 degrees either side of the vertical position to prevent possible flame impingement on the cylinder head and correction position can be obtained by using the 2602-8 full thickness washer, 2602-8A half thickness washer. All right, three, replacing the valve. Cylinders must be completely empty with removing any of the cylinder relief valve. Place cylinder on the scale, connect the purge line, open the cylinder valve to prevent the excess flow of the checking from the closing exhaust gas gases until the scale balance or empty weight stamps on the cylinder. If the cylinder will not re reach the balance at an empty weight, this indicates the accumulation of heavy oil sludge in the cylinder, which may be drained but after the valve is removed. Whenever this condition is noticed, the filling plant, the valve must be removed to account upon positioning the drain by the... Before refueling, um, all right, this is a um, uh, checking valve. Valves are fitted with a lock nut resilient washers for easy properly locating valve outlet with a hole in the cylinder collar before inserting the valve in the cylinder. The lock nut must be packed up with the valve threaded as far as possible, ex exposing at least six threads at, of the, on the valve shank. The valve is then screwed with the cylinder back. The handle lasts five full turns before tightening is uh, then held to the position outlet opposite with the collar hole. While the lock nut is securely tightened, pre point pipe joint cement must not be used when the valve threads. After filling, repeat the above steps 2A, 2, 2B, 1, 2C1. No propane cylinders and storage transportation shall have the valve with outlet type. At least seal, the seal plug at all times, either fully empty, the plug shall be removed, and until they're installed in the cylinder full cabinet, it shall be replaced upon removal of the cylinder full fuel cabinet. 1. Fuel cylinder testing water jacket method. Introduction. Normal method have been developed in applying the Bureau of the Explosive Requirements Section A1. The testing fuel containers cylinders here and referred to as a 2 to s method of referring general use 1 accomplishing result of measuring the amount of liquid added to the cylinder resulting in the application of the test pressure. The other measure of the amount of water is displaced by the cylinder as a result of the application of the test pressure. The second method is one of the most generally used recommended to the equipment. Figure 3 shows the essential equipment for the making of these tests and valves. The water jacket in which the cylinder is to be tested placed with the complete with the cover of the clamps fitting the various valve the controlling low pressure and the high pressure water supply of the gauge indicated with the test pressure. A frame end which is mounted on the siding of the planet, panel O the panel um, holds the manometer glasses M. The ma panel can be raised, lowered, and turned Lowered by turning the crank handle P, the manometer gas is connected directly to the water jacket means the flexible rubber tubing a J. Each water jacket may have two or more manometer glasses 
Um, different diamond abuse collaboration, expansion of tank invasions, um, version, various um, sizes of conveniently accurate, accurately measured on open valve to left open, depending on the open upon the glasses used. The manometer gradually to read the cubic centimeter, the mark in the L, and mark in the, uh, in the pointer L fastened to the framework N, located in the direct horizontal line with the top valve with F. If the jacket covers the position, piston marks are permanent zero. Point. All right, three, the cylinder to be tested should be completed with filled with the liquid placed in the water jacket connected with the pressure line G, the means of the special condition clam. The water jacket should be then be completely filled with the water, closing valve B and opening valve A, the passing lids covered in place, face forms the more water in the jacket until it is cut overflows at a valve F, which is located at the highest point of the lid that ensures the removal of the air within the jacket to close the valve F and the system now being completely filled with water. The level manometer goes glass in zero mark will be coincide with the point permanent zero line indicated in the po pointer L. The cylinder must be subjected to rounding out the pressure of the not exceeding this ninety per cent prescribed lessing pressure with a hundred pounds thereof to be applied with the pressure slowly stenciled in the opening valve D. Pressure line and closing valve reading are not to be recorded during uh during route routine process, the pressure should be maintained sufficient length of the time and ensure the complete rounding of the, the cylinder, the release of the closing of the valve D and the opening of the valve E, level system to zero again and opening the valve F the, until excess water is removed from the tank. All right, you have your water jacket cover, your drain, your water jacket, L and M and L over here on the side, which is uh, um, your side paneling frame, manometer glass and the L pointer over the side. A is the inlet throttle valve, 2 is the outlet throttle valve, pressure line, by half force power valve, half HP valve, over half flow valve, clamp, flex pre pressure gauge, flexible rubber, global, global valves, and crank handle. Schematic diagram of the water jacket testing. All right, I'm putting, uh, reading where we left off. Apply pressure again in the slowly and steadily until the prescribed test pressure is reached with, with for example, 480 pounds for the I LI ICC Interstate Commission 4B 240 cylinder layer. Gauge H includes indicates 480 that pounds closed valve to maintain the pressure for 30 seconds longer. While the pressure has been applied with the cylinder steadily expand, therefore, with the forcing of the water, the jacket of the manometer, when the testing of the pressure for the 480 is being maintained with 30 seconds longer or lower, the sliding panel is zero until the liquid level of the manometer coincides with the permanent zero and is indicated with the pointer L. The reading on the manometer of the point of the total volumetric expansion of the cylinder of the cubic centimeters. It is a measurement of the displacement caused by the expansion of the cylinder, if therefore the direct measurement of the tool expansion of the cylinder. After 30 seconds of the elapsed relapse of the pressure for the valve, either the cylinder begins with the return of the original shape of the liquid that has been displaced, return to the jacket. As the liquid level um, falls in the manometer movement, manometer move the side panel O, the upward, when the entire pressure has been released, the pressure gauge H with return to the zero, adjusting the O, for the liquid level manometer coincides with the permanent zero L line, the manometer reading on the point of the permanent volumetric expansion, cubic centimeters. Um, this is a long chapter. I see how I got four requirements. No cylinder permanent volumetric expansion must not exceed the percent of the volumetric expansion prescribed in the test pressure. All cylinders subjected with the 12 in year to retest the permanent expansion must not exceed 10% of the total expansion. Cylinders have been expected the fire to be retested should be considerable to be satisfactory for use of the satisfactory pass the test. In the case of cylinders that must be reheated treated with the permanent expansion that must not be less than 3% or more than 10% of the total expansion provided. However, the cylinders so reheated that the test can be segregated with a lot of the same chemical composition. Lawable permanent expansion may be from 0 to 10 percent of the total expansion if one cylinder out of each has of 100 cylinders and less objective to pass the requirements of the physical test specified the specification manufacturer's type of the cylinders in question. 5. Checking the test apparatus. In order to check the thereby inaccuracy of the water jacket equipment the use of the calibrated cylinder of the records and recommended the Bureau of Explosives such that the cylinder have been carefully checked with the apparatus known to be accurate should be used to check the accuracy of the equipment at least once a day before each cylinder is tested and apparatus the less the frequently calibrated cylinders can be secured by the manufacturing of fuel, fuel containers. Section 3. Part 3. Water and Water slash Ice. And we're stopping there.